Luke chapter 2, 1 through 21. And it came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first made when Cyrenius was governor of Syria. And all went to be taxed, everyone into his own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, out of the of Nazareth, into Judea, unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and the age of David, to be taxed with Mary, his spouse's wife being great with child. And so it was that with her there, the days were accomplished that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son, and wrapped him, and swallowed him clothes, and laid him in a manger. So there was no room for them in the inn. And there were, in the same country, shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy. And this shall be a son unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill toward men. And it came to pass, as the angels were gone away from them into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us now go, even on bed unto Bethlehem, to th- see this thing which has come to pass, which the Lord hath made known to us. And they came with haste, and found Mary, and Joseph, and the babe, lying in the manger. And when they had seen it, they made known abroad the sayings which were told them concerning this child. And all they that heard it wondered at those things which were told them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things, and pondered them in her heart. And the shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all that they had heard and seen, which was told unto them. And when eight days were accomplished for the circumcising of the child, his name was called Jesus, which was so named of the angel before he was conceived in the womb.